Hey guys, Sam here from Super Squid Jump, and I'm just recording this quick video to say that there's been a new update announced for Splatoon 2. It, this is the holiday update, and it reveals four new maps, over 150 new gear, and a bunch of new weapons. This update also adds four new hairstyles, two for the male avatar and two for the female avatar. The first of the four new maps, fittingly releasing on Black Friday, is called Mako Mart. Apparently, it's the most popular superstore in Inkopolis. Multiple new weapons will be coming with the update as well. A popular return from Splatoon 1 is the Hydra Splatling. New weapons include a set of dualies that look like glue guns, a new squeezer weapon type, and a new umbrella, which is shown later in the video. Another new feature is the ability to take pictures with your amiibo on any stage with any weapon equipped. There are also more new poses, and you can use filters with your images. The second new map coming out, supposedly soon, is Schellendorf Institute. It looks like a museum of history, but I wish they were adding the museum from the original Splatoon. That one's much better. Coming out around the middle of December, maybe at the same time as the new as the second new map, is a new ranked mode, Clam Blitz. In it, the two teams have to collect clams hidden around the stage. After one's picked up, it follows the player. The objective is to throw the clam into the basket near the opponent's base. The first team to score 100 points wins, but things aren't as easy as they seem. The baskets are protected by a barrier, which must be destroyed first. After collecting 10 clams, the player will earn a power clam. It looks like a football, but it's the only way to break the barrier, so I guess I'm just going to have to roll with it. There are two more new maps returning from Splatoon 1. They are Walleye Warehouse and Arowana Mall. Arowana Mall was one of my favorite maps in Splatoon 1, and I'm glad to see it's making a return. want to clear up some things that were not in the video um it w appears that there's going to be a new salmon run stage added the same time as the first new stage so on black friday there will be a new salmon run stage it's called salmon and smoke yard and it says that there will be a wide gap on the beach that divides two upper platforms with fan lifts being the quickest way to tra traverse the two I don't really understand what this means, um, if someone else does, maybe they could help me in the comments. Anyway, there will also be new battle music, and all of this is coming out on the 20, 23rd, I think it is? I don't know. Anyway, this coming Friday. There are two new bands, so that probably means at least six new songs. Um, also, there are higher level caps. If you thought it was hard enough to get to level 50, now you can go to level 100, and then start right back over again at level star 1. So, basically infinite levels now. Um, finally, and this is the biggest one, people have been asking for this feature and since Splatoon 1. And it's that you can swap your gear, when you, and you don't have to leave the game you're playing. Um, I'll put up some footage of this, hopefully. But, normally you'd have to exit the game and rejoin a new one just to swap out your weapon or clothes. Now, you don't have to do that and you can just keep on playing. And I cannot, cannot express how great this feature right here is. It is, it's amazing. And I cannot wait simply because of this. As you might be able to see, I'm pretty psyched about these changes and you should be too. Anyway, that's all for today, so I'll see you in the next video. Sam, out! Wait, don't go just yet. I want to address a small concern, probably probably bigger than a small concern, but anyway, I want to address a concern that I did not get a video out for Splatfest, and the reason for that is crappy camera is crappy, and didn't get any footage because the battery died, and wouldn't charge. Um, Landon did get a video out for Splatfest, so I'll put a link to that somewhere, probably, maybe, I don't know. Anyway, go watch that.